Welcome everyone to the Ford post game. Time now to send you down to the field. Here's Kevin Nagandi. Sean, thank you very much. Congratulations, Clemson, on advancing to the national title game for the third time in four years. Dabo, I know this is a special, special night for you to present the, the Goodyear Cotton Bowl Classic Trophy. Here's Chairman Carl Ice of the Goodyear Cotton Bowl Classic. Great game, Coach. Congratulations. On behalf of our board of directors and staff, we'd like to present you the Field Scoville Trophy for winning the 83rd. Good year, Cotton Bowl Classic. Thank Good you. luck next week. Thank you so much. Thank you. Dabo, what does this moment mean to you when you're talking about this specific team? Your third trip to the national championship in four years. What about this specific team that makes it special? Well, it means we're going to Cali, baby. Here we come. What makes this team special is the leadership across the board. We had 26 guys get votes for captain. We had 66 guys make a 3.0 or better. That's a school record. But the heart of our team, the focus of this team, the unbelievable consistency of this team all the way through the season, and, and this is just a very close group, but the leadership is what makes it special. These seniors just won their 54th game, four ACCs, three national championships now and uh, you got to give the credit to them because they this is what they set out to do and uh, we haven't been here since 1939 but this 2018 Clemson uh, version is ready to go to California and your Cotton Bowl champs here yes. you talk about the senior leadership and you're led on the field by a true freshman quarterback. You make the decision in September. What did he show you tonight on the big stage, Trevor Lawrence, leading this offense? Well, that's the easiest question I'm going to get all night because uh, 50 million people probably saw the same thing. But he's just, he's an unbelievably gifted player. He's way mature for his years. He's got tons of poise. He's a very, very smart player, but he's just got a gift, ability to be able to see the field, make the right decisions, and then, and then deliver the ball on time. But... He just, he just gets it to the guys that we have around him. We've got a great supporting cast. And, again, I think that says a lot about the leadership we have on this team, that a freshman steps in and they rally behind him like they did. And then he's got that offensive line in front of him. We didn't play great in the first half, but, man, we took it over in the second half, and the big plays were the difference in the game. You often talk about the Clemson culture. It's not about one player, not about one coach. What is that Clemson culture? Well, it's, it's about uh, an attitude of belief no matter what, first of all. A can-do attitude no matter what. And it's just a culture that is driven by relationship. You know, it, we, a, gener, a, a, a truly genuine appreciation for each other, you know, in each other's role. From the people who clean the building uh, to myself, to our, our board of trustees, to the, to the guys who don't play, the scout team guys. Just a, an appreciation for everybody's role and what it takes to be able to you know, celebrate a moment like this. How are you going to celebrate tonight? Well, we're going to, we'll figure that out. We're going to go in that locker room and we're going to dance. We're going to turn it up. Give me a, give me a moment here. Give me a moment here. Go, let's see the dance. And then we're going to pack up and then we're going home and we're going to get ready for the next one. But tonight, tonight, it's about celebrating this one right here. Dabo, congratulations. Thank you. And to God, What does this moment? What does this moment? What does this moment mean to you coming back for another season at Clemson? Hey man, I mean this is really special. Um, you know this group of guys that I go to work with every day. This group of seniors, man, they put their all on the line each and every day. We got great leadership on this team. It's truly amazing. It's truly special. You know this is what we set out to do. We set out to be our best and. I mean, now we're going back to the national championship, but I'm looking forward to it. It's the most serious I've seen you all night. You were having fun all over the field. To, to the idea that fought, you fell short last year in the semis to go to the national championship, was that the goal all season? I mean, well, the goal was just to be the best that we can be, and if it meant going to the national championship, then that's just a result of being the best we could be, and I'm just happy we were able to do it. I mean, we got the best fans in the nation. They always come out to show the support. I mean, I know they'll show up in Cali, and I mean, I'm, I'm just looking forward to next week. That freshman quarterback, Trevor Lawrence, when you watch him play, what do you see? Uh, he's okay. Um, he's all right. He's a, 
He's, he's above average player. No, he's pretty good, man. He's special, and it's just fun to watch him grow and how he commands the offense and does things like that. I mean, you know, he's, it's, just, it's just fun to watch. Christian, congratulations. Thank you so much. Appreciate you, sir. We'll see you next yes, week. Sir. Oh, yeah. Clemson returning to the national championship game. Next week, they'll face the winner of Alabama or Oklahoma. Sean? One more time.